window of Henry's face, and we can see this we can go on the side. Oh, yeah, of course, but they ain't going to be Hillary, no. Hillary, Hillary is a, 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 like any politician, is, uh, it's like choosing the worst, the best of two evils. Right now, we got a choice to choose the best of two evils. Right now, so I would not have to be that way. They need to cancel this whole left right. Program. But they ain't gonna do that. They ain't gonna do that because it's it's it's, it's, it's if you if you watch the Declaration of Independence and all these documents signed, it'll never change. It, it'll it's never change. It should. I know. It should, but it'll never change. But the problem with Trump, the problem with Trump and and, and Clinton is that and, and everybody around the country, around the world, is so worried about this because they know if this fool, how in the hell are you gonna give a guy like Trump? The keys to the to the to the nuclear code. I'd be more worried about Hillary. Having. No, I wouldn't. Really. No, what I said, absolutely. No, absolutely. But I said she ain't gonna use it. Remember, I said this. I read everything that's been going down with Libya and Iraq and all those places. She she would be harder and quicker to go into Iraq because she part of the whole. I'm not saying the war. I said the nuclear weapons. I'm saying I'm saying the reason I know that she wasn't that she always had her hands on the nuclear code. Never since she never had the option. Trust me, this is what we're gonna do. But I'm saying that, but she always had her hands on the nuclear code because she sleep right next to the guy that had the nuclear code. He talks to his knee. He knows everything. All she gotta do is get out of his circle. All she gotta do is get out of his circle. His name was she ain't doing that. Oh yeah, she, oh yeah, she is. She did it early. My point to it is that she That's already knows all this shit. Yeah, but I hear what you're saying. But no, 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 no. Whatever you do, yeah, brother. Have to go progressive. Yeah, but whatever you do, don't ever think, don't ever think, don't ever think this is the worst thing that could possibly happen for the United States. You talking about race riots and riots and that's what happened anyway. Only this immediate problem. No, no, I'm not. It's not even about Trump. Trump they're bro, using bro, these things to build bro, up. Bro, bro. They, they, hey, they do want to. I hear, I hear. But then that's what that's, that's what that's what that's what he's setting up for. Because if you look at the look at the it two it conventions, it ain't necessarily him. Trust me, it's him. Everything about it is him. Look at the two conventions. It's so stark, so necessary. You look at that one convention, man, and you look at the faces on all those individual devils on that side. And what I mean by when you look at the faces, every one of them in there was what they were. Right. Now, when you look at the faces on the other side, it's everything. So how can you, as one individual, know that this guy is preaching this with all these guys? That's how you think he's going to get in. The problem that he has is that he has alienated so many individuals that he'll lose probably, he even put states in the play that shouldn't even be in the play. Here's, here's why his audience looked the way it is. Oh, they say no mention. Oh, no, no. This is a Republican. The Republican base has always been white. No, no, no. They are different they, now. They're gonna always have that. But they but they different now because they even they, when, when Herbert McCann was running, it's just kinda of, he had a lot of good stuff, but his audience was still all white. But, but your point, I'm not saying this about the audience. I'm saying how he didn't guide it. The two, the three, the four, the five main people in the king, in terms of being now, they realize they sit back and saying, Whoa, what are we doing? That's why you hear all these white folks that one Republican, the one that said we stand away. Because they're not gonna get caught because they know this stuff gonna explode. But a lot and when of they coming in, they actually bring but, more, more people. But they bring it. I'm talking about all the individuals that's the establishment of the public. Don't let them think. Don't let this fool you. All these old ex presidents, yeah. old, all right. These oh, individuals are staying so far away because of the fact they know this situation for the blow. Or maybe they're staying away because he don't represent the rest of the the, uh, the establishment yeah. figure that the Republicans are. Everything he's saying is actually on the outside of the Republicans. That's what they're trying Republican. to make you believe. But he's French. He's, nothing, ain't nothing. Ain't nothing. Ain't nothing new about Trump. Trump yeah, was the yeah. same guy. Say Trump was the same guy when that World Trade Center fell down, and when he and everybody else was sitting up and talking about this money, he didn't go out and fight for it and ask for it. But when it became available, he said, "I want one hundred fifty thousand dollars for one of my." Now, which one of these towers was his business? Because he's a business. But what? Now, now that's the, the, that insurance. That's what he's supposed to do. That's Trump. He should have been shot in the head because you <laughs> could you couldn't do it. You couldn't go in there and say, you know, when you had a bit, he took businesses. He took that money away from small businesses that was in, 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 in New York. Yeah. That's what's so sad about it. Back I ain't saying his practice is ain't shady, but that's that's who ain't he's, shady. He's, he's on that level. Everything he's about everything everything about this guy is demonic. Now, if, now don't get me wrong. Hillary, Hillary got a lot of demonic. Hillary got a lot of demonic. Now, don't get me wrong. Hillary is the devil. But, but no, 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 no. But the devil is 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 the devil's any, alive. The devil is either one of these individuals. It's like you choose the worst of the best of two evils. And right now, for me, for me to know that what's here at that stake right now. The best of two of you for me is Hillary Clinton. This, this house because she can be controlled. She gonna get in anyway, but it's gonna be because she stole it. It's gonna be. It's gonna be. Stole it. It's gonna come. Gonna be nah, because of nah, votes. Don't nah, don't get it. Don't nah. get it twisted. That's what Bernie Sanders thought. But it wasn't about stealing. The people she had more. She had more votes than. It's gonna be like Bush and Gore and uh, or Gore. No, they ain't gonna be that close. I'll jet ticket. Oh, it, yeah. ain't, it ain't gonna be that close. If, yeah. if it ain't close, man, it's gonna be a blowout. It's gonna be it's gonna be a blowout. So crazy this shit. He might not win. He might he might win I, just I the southern states. It won't be a blowout in the Democratic. Uh,
Hello. Oh, there you go. Oh. Hello. Yes, ma'am. I'm just really gonna say I'm just living there. Hey, Ann. How are you? Oh my God, I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, I'm doing great. I tried calling you back yesterday. I was not even in touch with the guy, but I did email this and I told her. So she responded yeah. back and said she was gonna definitely reach yeah. out yeah. to yeah. him. Yeah. Yeah. I left your number to the office there and the information, plus I gave him the cell phone number of my contact, the guy that works, you know, that comes out of the So what we're trying to do right now is try to see if we can put this fire out. If not, I'm going to have to, next time we talk, I'll give you something a little bit more direct that you can have some individual information. I'm not doing that. No, 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 no. Yeah, but it's, it's okay. a happy one to stay. Well, hey, I, I, I totally understand, but like I said, trying try to get the from the turn is going to be interesting oh. anywhere you go. I'm trying to see if I get you your money. Who says the place? Right. You, uh, you can do the other day. Okay, I'm clear. Yeah. It's a crystal. Other day? Thank you. You talking about yesterday? Yeah. Other than what we did at that spot. Can you do this somewhere else? No, we were working on that one the whole day. Oh, yeah, so that's it. But, so that's it. Same, 40 old Sam, you know what I'm saying? Because it's just for, you know, what he, he did in the background, too. He cut the back, and he also did the other stuff. And then uh, the spot on Murray Hill, taking the whole job. You get the pictures on it? Yeah. Just so you can see what it was. I got very different cops. That's what you're talking about. Uh, all the stuff is on the house and the driveway yeah. where the car yeah. goes back. Yeah. 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 We didn't get a chance to get that dirt back in there around there. Nah, nobody had a shovel. Okay. So we'll have to come back. Let's get a shovel. Yeah, I'll try to see if I can touch me down and go over there and do that. Russian Air Force Army so, that was a lot of work. That, that so, was, so was Bernie your man from the beginning? No, not at all. I mean, to be absolutely honest, to be absolutely honest, I know, you know, from, 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 from day one, it's about choosing the worst, the, the best of two evils. I have to go where, where, where my thought and looking at everybody else that I believe in and where they're going. You know, I, I don't know Hillary personally, but I know that she's been around for a long time and I know she's a snake. She's about a bigger, but, but Donald Trump is the worst kind of blood sucker I ever seen. My, Donald Trump is the kind of guy I grew up with. And that's why my uncle on the other side. Donald Trump is that kind of guy. Everything that comes out of his mouth, how he responds, how he do certain things, I know his character. And this guy is everything about the devil. And, and what I mean by that is that he's not for nobody but Trump. When you get an individual that's trying to run a country, and you sit up and saying, I'm going to do this. When everybody, when a person put that individual, I can do this, I can do that, knowing that it's going to be impossible to run a country by yourself. You're going to need everything around it. That's when you worry about it. That's when a guy think he's more powerful than God. When you say, I. I'm only person that should say, I. That I ever known about should be God. Because then God symbolized all of us. He's the only one that I can just point my finger at and say, that's the power. I can't point my finger at Donald Trump and say he's the power. I can't point it at Hillary Clinton. But I'm just saying, I can't point my finger at him. He reminds me of an uncle that I had, man, that sent so many people to jail. Family members. That did so many right things that taught us every right trick in the book. I've seen guys like Donald all my life. And I know Donald's character, he should have been shot in the head a long time ago. And now he got secret service, it's a bad situation, <laughs> brother. I'm just saying, if he get in there, the worst thing that can happen to this earth is that it may blow up with this food. Because his, his he don't have he doesn't have the kind of fortitude to think things through like Obama do. Obama's one of those thinkers. He didn't but talk Hillary Clinton how to be a thinker. Keep this in mind, though, like you said. There's no I, there's a we. Not any one person runs the country. So you can't expect that one person, good or bad, is going to break, make or break the whole thing. Okay. He, he, doesn't he got his hands on the nuclear code. Well, he don't alone make the decisions to just blow up a whole other Yes, planet. he has his hands. He's the This is what I'm saying. He has access to. No, 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 no. You have to understand. You have to understand the power. You have to understand the power that they give the President of the United States. Yeah, he has executive order. No, no. You have to understand the power that they give the President of the United States. He has his fingers on the nuclear code. Anybody who sits in that seat has access. No, no. He has his fingers on the This guy that walks see, around the football. You see, you see this guy that walks around the football all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The guy. Yeah. Every time he go, he's always right there. He has his fingers. 
This bag is sitting right next to his bed when he's down there sleep. Now think about this. So if you got a businessman who wants to make as much money as possible. A uh, who? <laughs> oh, come on, business. Look, brother, I hear you, man, loud and clear, and I feel what your spirit is, and, and don't get me wrong. Let me hear the sentences. Okay, let me hear the sentence. Okay, okay I got to hear the sentence. You got somebody who's maybe he's all about self and he's focused on money. He's talking about he's got those relationships, now he's doing some stuff with Russell. You think maybe he might want to expand his brand and get in other places? Hell oh, no, he already there. Hold on. So it's about more, more recent influence. Or you got somebody who's like, hey, this thing ain't really about business, it ain't about money, it ain't about clout, it's about power. I'd be more concerned with somebody who wants more and more power having access to, to kill other places than somebody who just who's consumed with their own greed. Well, it's about what you surround really yourself want. around. The, only, the thing that makes me so oh, fake about it is that she got her husband sitting right there. He ain't nobody. He ain't never been nobody. Who? Cool. But when you want to talk Bill? about when they surround, who they surround Bill? 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 <laughs> who does Trump Bill built about one who? of the best presidents we've had in the last 50 years. Yeah. But you talking about who, Besides who, Obama? who surround themselves with. That's one person. Yeah, she's married, so that's one thing. But what's the rest of her circle? The rest Where? of her circle going to be what you see a around Obama. That's the rest of her circle. You're going to see John Kerry. You're going to see all these individuals. Yeah, yeah, the people on the Facebook. And, and even, if, even if we're not going to go on another level, you're talking about John Kerry, all the people that's on the surface. That's so powerful, think, man. Yeah, but think about what those, all the same agendas that's being pushed since Bush, since Obama, since Clinton. It's the same dynasty going on. But we're going in the right America. direction. Are we, though? Oh, of course. Are we, though? Right, well, look, then then look. why is the biggest message of uh, make America great again, let's bring change? We don't have to agree with it. But why do so many people feel like, yeah, I'm It ain't something, but it ain't that many people. See what you're saying? But he's blowing all the records apart. He blew everybody apart. But he blowed he blow, 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 the But my point is he blowed a Republican. See, when you look at the primary, and right. you got 16 people running, and the average uh, amount of votes that this guy gets is 34%. Right. The reason he gets 34% is because they split the vote between everybody else. Now when it comes down to a big national election, and it starts off from scratch, Right. It ain't gonna be the blow, and you'll see after this after this convention, it's gonna show you something that's gonna be so clear. And I and I can probably mark my word on this right now. They're head and head, and the Eagle, and the Trump got a little bit of a bump. But after this convention, and when you go back next week, and I'm not even talking about the polls, and I don't even believe it. I believe that no, right I mean, now. I don't believe that as far as I can go. Anyway. But no, no, they, and they don't. It's, it's, it's the polls. They, they they literally calling a hundred people. They not calling a million people. They ain't calling. They calling a thousand people and interviewing a thousand people. And out of that thousand people, is how they get their they numbers. Right. It's ridiculous. Right. You know, it's ridiculous. That's not even an accurate count. Then. But here goes the here goes the exciting part about the about the whole setup. Right now, when this when the, when the, when the election take place that day, the Democrats automatically are gonna start with two hundred and thirty or two hundred and twenty something. Votes for the electoral, the electoral votes. The Republican automatically starts with 160. All the Democrat has to do is win one state out of eight, and they're going to get the election. If that's how it starts. Now, what, what they're trying to do is put these other states in play. Let me tell you about the other five states that came in play because of that red states. You got Atlanta, Georgia. You have Atlanta, Georgia. And we've seen it changing. It's always been red, but it has started turning color because, of, right. the, the, because it's been unbalanced. Yeah. There's so many people that feel so uncomfortable. There's a lot of people that Trump gonna have because they're gonna be Republicans. They're gonna draw a few new people out of there, but it's gonna be so impossible for him to beat the alignment that they're gonna throw him because they it, it, no matter what comes out on Hillary, they can if she can come out right now, they can show all kinds of stuff. The problem is that they're not gonna vote for Donald Trump. He's gonna get his votes from his people. It's but like, that's what I say in the beginning that it's, it's almost geared to be a setup when it was burning. Every, when everybody was all out there, when it was all fresh and new, and you didn't know who was going to be what. I'm saying the whole setup looks like it's geared to be where Trump's going to say all the crazy stuff. He's going to get the most attention. It's going to end up being the, hold on, hold on. It's going to look as if he's going to be the nominee, which now he is. So that's turned out to be the case. And people in the end who don't like Hillary, they're going to feel like they're going to say exactly what you're saying now. That's what, remember what I said earlier? Yeah. That's going to be the worst of two evils. They're going to feel like, oh, of course. They're going to feel like, well, we can't have somebody like Trump, so we got to pick Hillary. So and that's like, why a lot of people are leaning on the with now. So you had to have a, a big push behind Trump to knock out any other likely real candidates that were Republicans that actually could have been a decent choice. Neither one of them. They, they, right now, the right now, everything I mean, that they had running. Could not touch it. They didn't even put the Rubio boy in there because he was Hispanic. He was but my, my point is, he was Hispanic. He could have yeah. split their vote. Now, all they need to do is get 37% or 40% of the Hispanic vote that they in. 
See, the problem is... Hey, they weren't going to go with that because Ruben was obvious that he was a robot. They broke that apart real quick. But by the point, it's the same thing with Big Cruz. Another Hispanic. But nobody trusted him anyway. But it's a certain basic underground... They don't really trust Trump. That's what I'm saying. That's what some crazy people do. That's people only feel they got some kind of trust for him because he, he don't talk like a politician. Well, that's he, what they keep saying. You, you ain't been sold and told. He sound like an idiot stupid. to me. Every time this boy opened his mouth, but it's off the top. Everybody says it's stupid. But no, but no, no, no. But you can't keep off the top. You know what I mean? You can't do it. He but, stay off the top. But, but that's that's why this brother's a master freestyle. Yeah, 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 he really is. But he's an entertainer. And he make it make sense. And that people just want to be entertained. But he's making, and you hit the right on point. He's making it want. make sense to some of the people. But the masses of you, when you start talking about, that's the sad part. But when you start talking about hundred million, but when you start, but but here go, here go the key. But when you start talking about hundred million people voting in the election, he only got sixteen million breaking the ceiling from the Republicans from where he was at in terms of the voting that's there. Does the, when you say the deck is stacked, the, when they get to that electoral college. Every Republican will be at a disadvantage from this point because of the fact that's why Obama won two terms. That's why Clinton won two terms. In between, they stole that first election and it made it easy after the war was there for the second one to do. It was simple. But it's going to be very difficult, very difficult for them to break that electoral college. He's going to lose, but they keep talking about how close Pennsylvania is because all those blue devils going to go against the grain. What's going to beat Trump? It's all these suburban white women. They are not going to vote for a man that's not the, that don't believe in their rights. And that's why Hillary's going to blow this thing so far open, because so many people don't want to see a woman as president. All the, the women got us outnumbered 60, 60 to 40. Up. They want that because they want to buy the ticket. But, she's, but, she's she's both, but she's the most qualified candidate right now. Actually, all, all the way against the things that they want. She's no, no. That's what they're trying, they're trying to make you believe. Wait, uh, uh, but I took her history. I, I don't have to. You, I, you, I, know, I, you, you know That's you know what I'm saying. That's why I know history. history. Uh, the only history she has that's, that's a little bit different is that she likes the idea of being able to go into a certain country like she messed up in Libya to try to take over certain countries because of the currency. Because we talked about this once before. Uh, I get this. Right. I get it wholeheartedly. Right. But, What's going on, man? Where do you come from? Where do you come from? You was with y'all all the time? Oh, okay. Damn! I just feel it's going to be an impossible situation that's going to go down. And what's, and what might end up happening, the frightening part about it, even though he's running for president, if they find any kind of connections with this Russia thing, you talking about a conspiracy? You talking about a person getting arrested? That's this is what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. If they well, find out, she's involved in way more conspiracy. No, no, but, but this is this is this. It's, it, but it's this. The whole history is conspiracy. But that's what they're making you think. But here goes, nah, they're they're going to shock us. The conspiracy is. thing is, is when you allow another country like Russia to come in and put their hands on the scale of an election that's going on in the United States. They messed around and they let this boy from Israel do it just recently. Yeah, yeah. The, they let him, they let him they come in and speak. And, they, well, they let him come in and speak. At the UN. But, the, that, the, that, and, and, and but, but that was the whole point. But that, that, was, the, that was one of the things. But they're not going to But he's, a, he's an ally. Nothing happened with it. But he's an ally. I'm talking about an enemy. I'm talking about the number one enemy that we can physically have for the last 200 years has been Russia. And if they allow this fool, Putin, to put his hands on the scale here and find out that Trump had anything to do with it, he ain't gonna be just it's he ain't gonna just be indicted on it. They gonna put him in front of a firing squad and, and pull his fucking head off. I'm gonna be the I'm gonna be the first one pulling the trigger. And I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna pray to God, I'm gonna pray to Allah, I'm gonna pray to everybody I gotta pray to. Please let this bullet hit this fool right in his forehead. And, and I'm gonna make sure I'm aiming at that. That's just the way I feel. He reminds me of an uncle. And the only reason I say that is because I had an uncle that sounded just like Trump. He was a type of individual that says everything off the top of his head. He was as smooth as silk. He had everything he wanted to have. But he convinced individuals around him to be as deceitful, to be as crazy as he possibly can. Now, don't get me wrong. I know Hillary's character. You can tell Hillary's character. But Hillary is just like any other women. Hillary is just like any other women. She could be president, but she still could be somewhat controlled. You ain't gonna be able to control Trump. See, see, that's it depends on what level you look at. The fact that you can be controlled now, you gotta ask who's doing the control. Well, I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm saying the truth. You, if you know those puppet masters that's been doing the control since the inception of this whole shit, you know it's gonna. Who be, is it? Well, now we now we go with the luminaries. Come on, now you go. I know where you're going. I already know where you're going. Where you going? Where you going? Where you going? Where you going? You take away. You're talking about all the connections between Obama being the. Being the cousin of, of, of Bush and yes. being the cousin
worse than a Donald Trump and, and all this other stuff. Let's get it. That's not even where I was going. I know, but I'm, I want to take it there, though. I want to take it there. That's not what I'm talking about. Look, I talked to a lot of I talked to a lot of Republicans. I talked to a, I got one of my my, my Daryl got it. He's the biggest militant you ever seen in your life. Biggest Republican you ever seen. He, he, he's the black Republican. He's proud of it. He'll be the first one to tell you, man, fuck these monkeys. Fuck these black motherfuckers. I don't care nothing about them. These monkeys, they all should be took and shot and hung up. That's the way he talk. But his whole theory is. Yeah, but I'm, I'm, that, that, that's Donald Trump. That's what I'm saying. That's Donald Trump. Donald Trump is the same as this guy here. He's just saying it in a different way. It means the same. Fuck all these monkeys. Fuck a black motherfucker. Did you see it? Fuck a black, fuck a red, fuck a blue. It's all about white. When it's like that, he needs to be shot in his head. He needs to be like the most mangy dog he is. Took out in the middle of the street. Not only shot his head, but run him over about 25 times. And back up over his head. And run him and back up. Just keep going. And after you put three bullets in his head. So Tell us how you really feel. No, I'm just talking about Trump. And that's the way I feel. Okay. I do not like. You sound more personally invested because it's not so much about Trump, it's about your uncle. You see him. I do like, racist speech. No, no, you want to take it out? No, 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 but I do racist speech. <laughs> I do racist speech. So what, what I understand is when you look at that boy Emmett Till sitting up in this casket. Y'all yeah, seen the bra. When well, you see Emmett Till sitting his hand, his head this big, and you sit up there and think about the fight and the cause that all these individuals have died for. And, and, and make well, we can sit up here now and be entrepreneurs and do what we want to do. This stuff didn't never happen. This stuff would have never happened if certain individuals didn't get their head knocked in or been bleeding or been shot or been killed or been something. Right. That's what gets me. And Trump sounds like the so same individual that would that, that physically right now would see an Emmett Till and kill Emmett Till. When he started, them black boys would start getting shoot, shoot, getting shot. What did he say? He don't give a fuck about us. No, at you least I can say Hillary Clinton. Clinton. Like you said, he's all about self. But he ain't gonna speak on. Well, that's that's why I feel the way I feel about him. That's a political thing to do. No, no, but that's the way. It has nothing to do with political. That's the way he think. In the end, this is what it's gonna come down to. It's gonna be Hillary because it was always designed to be. But watch what we get into when she get in. No, hell, hell, it ain't gonna be no more no. what we hear now. I'm hoping. No. I'm hoping that. Oh, oh no! Look, the world is already going in a different direction, bro. The world is already like almost there. You know, God is almost ready to make that return anyway. I already ain't there. If we can't see that. But watch some of the things that happen and, and you'll be able to see the signature of who initiated certain things. Well, I she got She's going to have a lot to do with them. But, but, but she, that we wouldn't have done anything. Well, I mean, she was. So you're saying when, when, when Russia, when they find out that Russia is doing something against the grain and she say, oh, you better back up before I put a bullet in your head. And Russia said, oh, you're going to put a bullet. But see, what you don't understand is all these little countries that you're talking about, even Russia with all this stuff, they don't have that kind of power. You know, if you look at around the world, you look at around, this is the, the best thing about Obama, people talk to me, black and blue in the state. Look at around the world, look at all these economies that's out there. Every one of them is suffering and fucked up. We're not fucked up. They keep talking about what's here and what's not here. Look at what's going on here, man. The, the, kind of, the, the kind of gradually change that we've had over the last eight years. We're the only country that's still sustaining everything. We can push a button. We can say, we can say right now, let's stop Russia. From, let's, let's stop their currency from growing. And what happens? Their currency stopped growing. They invented some serious shit over there, so of you course. Can't sanctions, but you can't stop them. Well, they invented it. The only one that's benefiting over there is Putin. You can't stop Putin. I'm saying, but it ain't about to stop Putin. All those people over in that country are suffering so bad right now. Oh, they're suffering. They're the only ones that's not suffering. you talking about, that's why you don't see all the rioting and stuff in the street. That's why you don't see all the killing and the locking up. They ain't going to show you that because their media's on lockdown. They can't show you that. But they, their country is so screwed up right now that the only ones that are getting money is the ones at the top. Now here, you can say that, but are you getting some money? Come All right. I mean, if he was in Russia, he was in Russia, this wouldn't be happening. Right. I'm just being real. I know that. If you was in Russia, this would you can be in in China. This wouldn't be happening. They control those individuals here. Here's the land of the free, man. You can be and do whatever you want to do. There's no limit to how much money you can make if that's what you want to do. You can't do that in all these other places. You better know somebody to be able to get that money or you better be born into it. And, if you, and you better be graceful enough to these individuals so they can let you keep it. 
That's what they're doing now. Look at all the chaos every place else. If that stuff ain't here, we got a little chaos going on where the police are shooting and the, and the black folks are shooting, but that's, yeah, they've been doing that for a hundred years. Right. They've been hanging us. They've been literally hanging us from trees. I mean, so, you know, I mean, what they can throw at us right now don't mean nothing, but if we get Trump in the office, man, we might as well just, I mean, the world is almost close to where it needs to be, so all I can tell you is do is make peace with God. You better hurry up and try to get someplace and, get, and talk to your God and get as close to him as possible. So when this stuff happens, you know what side of the fence you're on. But if you're on the wrong side of the fence, that same thing that we're going through right now, you'll be going through through eternity. But if you're on that right side of the fence, oh my God, you're going to see so much beautiful stuff that you can get. You know, one thing I learned a long time ago, and I, I heard an individual church, and the person made, and I think about my mama now, and I think about my mama, because my mama believes so much in the Lord. That I knew when she had a chance to get a glimpse of heaven, there wasn't no coming back here. Why would she want to? I mean, I know she's going to miss all of us. She's all this family and all that. But when God shows you what's on the other side for you, oh, it's on, bro. So as much as I can tell you, brother, just get close to God. I don't care about Putin. I don't care about Trump. I don't care about uh, 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 Hillary Clinton. Make your peace with God. And believe me, God gonna take care of the rest. If he wants Trump in there, Trump gonna be in there. He already knows that. He already knows who's gonna be there. He already knows everything that's gonna happen. It's already been predetermined. He's the only one that knows. So when we start talking about all the things that's gonna go on around us, if God don't want the devil to win, the devil is not gonna win. If he wants the God. devil to win, My God. it's gonna be a temporary yeah. victory. It's a lot. Yeah, just put on the seat, my seat. It's just gonna be a temporary victory. That's all. We've had every get around. You safe? All right, man. Have you talked to the country today? Hey, I may go to the left. Oh, God. It's them. There? It's them. No, I see him. Yeah, you oh, talking to him? I mean, uh... Oh, yeah. Jason. I'm on my way to see Jason right now. Okay, you finna go. Okay. Here, grab it up. You can't grab it. He's, you got to meet him on the east side, west side. Rooms. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm about.